the one and only xylophony here to eat fish. Just kidding, I, I hate eating seafood. But the sea serpents are going to destroy the legendary fisherman and his army of watery things. So, Mario, think you got what it takes, huh? I'm gonna stomp you, bro. I just realized I'm Aquaman in this. Oh man, are you, are you like Aquaman, Aquaman, or are you like Jason Momoa? I'm the new cooler Aquaman that I actually use a spear. Someone Photoshop Mario as Jason Momoa. Though, of course. <laughs> Please that don't. actually feels like it would work magnificently. Oh, I don't want to see that on Twitter. And then all I want to see that so badly. <laughs> Somehow it'll work, Mario. It'll work. Anyway, yeah. So the clash of the waves coming out here. I know your deck, so I know you don't like going first with that deck. Definitely. Um, so, might as well just go for a little Moray of Greed, get these Poseidras back into deck. Get more cards. Um, okay, so this would have been great second turn, but let's uh, just do a... I could do another Moray of Greed, but that's a little risky at this point. Hmm. Um, I guess I can just still get more cards out of it. Moray of Greed! I have so many good cards in my hand. We're actually gonna ditch the deep sea diva. Throw it back mm. in because I'm, because I'm just gonna pull it. Well, I was gonna pull it right back out with Neptibus's effect, but instead I just drew it again, so that works. Urgh, but yeah. unfortunately, with all that draw power, I drew a dragoons, and now I'm out of Marais. So definitely, my previous hand was much better. Um, but I still got a bunch more sea monsters, so I uh, there's uses for him. So let's just go for a nice juicy little Neptibus. Start you off, activate it, get the um, existing. Get the existing Dragoons out of here, so I can get two things to my hand. We will add to my hand, um, of course, Poseidra. And that will let me add... You know what? With this hand and with how things are going... Eh, I want to go, go for the full combo, let's be honest. So let's grab Heavy Infantry. So now I got the combo pieces in my hand to open up next turn if you don't OTK me. I don't expect to be OTK'd by fish, but you never know. Yeah, never know. Um, let's go Link Karibo. Because why not? Don't. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to have another Neptibus on the field next turn anyway, so there's no reason to try to save it. Ooh, the Marais coming out here. Oh, yeah. yeah I'm actually kind of terrified of eels. <laughs> like, wasn't it Wasn't it an eel that killed the, uh, uh, the alligator? What was his name? The guy who was a fun, it was uh, famous for going, like, the alligator hunter, I think. Oh, crocodile hunter, man. The crocodile nah, it was hunter, a stingray. Yeah. It was a stingray. Was it a stingray? Oh, yeah. okay. Don't get your Steve Irwin right. R.I.P. Too soon, man. Too soon. It's been a while, but mm -hmm. that, that actually it's did been... hit me and my family hard because me and my brother, we love our animals. He was a, he was the man. Yeah. Oh, geez, double Marais for both of us. <laughs> yeah, you ever see four Marais played in two turns? Make it five. I keep drawing the same Craw card too. Oh. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I should have I should have stuck with my hand after the first Marais, but I mean, this is I still have a good hand. So. Okay, so I'm going to do. Okay, so. Yeah, I'm going to normal mean. summon, Force Resonator. Okay. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Okay, so, I'm just so, I so I could have got my Neftibus out there, but oh well. Yes, attack him directly. No! Smack him. <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah, I'm going to have to end the turn there. Okay. So let's see what we're going to do here. Um, now, can I OTK now? Well, kill now. Um, I can do a lot. I can do a whole lot. But we're going to normal summon my most powerful monster. Atlantean Heavy Infantry, because it lets me get another normal summon. Deep Sea Diva, and we all know what's coming next. Neptibus. Um, now, both of my um, Dragoons are already, well, used up, considering one's still in my hand. So, we're not going to get the double search off, but we will get one. Now, I already have a Poseidra, so we don't need that. Um, so, what do I want to send to the graveyard? Can I double Poseidra here? Yeah, I guess I can. So, we'll do that. And then, what am I activating here? Um, no, I don't want to link Karibo, you crazy. Let's see, and I can add to my hand by doing that. Um, we'll get the call of the Atlanteans for later. And now, we will activate from hand Poseidra. Did I normal summon? Yeah, of course I did. I normal summon twice, what am I thinking? 
So we can flip these dudes out. Get a Poseidra. Pop the effects of all these dudes. Force Resonator gone. Special summon the Poseidra we just sent. But I think that's that. Um, can't can't fully kill me this turn. Nope. I wanted to get the um, the Mermail card to my hand because then I would have been able to. Um, mm -hmm. And I would have if I didn't hard draw Dragoons. But I did hard draw Dragoon, Dragoons. So the Marae of Greed is absolutely what sunk me. Pun intended. <laughs> all right, you do all that. And I mm -hmm. think I can do a big... I think it can blow up next turn as well. Awesome. Good to see. Um, yeah, because definitely Poseidon as long does as you a don't whole have a lot solve. more when you have more things on the field. Uh, I can tell you right now, I don't. <laughs> or a bottomless. I don't have a solemn. <laughs> you have a bottomless, though. I didn't say that, Mario. I didn't say that. Okay. If you have a monster in your graveyard... So what are you doing? Oh, I I can't. Okay. Aww. So what? Okay, so I need it. Okay, so I might as well just tell you since you might just finish. Sure. You're definitely gonna. Yeah. Wait, can they pierce at all? No, they can't pierce, but I have more plays. So, and mm -hmm. I have a regeki. Okay, yeah. So what was gonna happen is, if I was, I thought I could special summon fish borg since I was reading his effect. I thought since all my monsters in the graveyard was water, hence why I was trying to get him in the grave, mm -hmm. uh, I can special summon him so I can use him as a tribute to get out Legendary Fisherman and then go straight into Legendary Fisherman 3 using him. Oh. But what's... But he can only be special summoned if he's in the grave. Oh, so you want to get him to the grave earlier. Okay. Gotcha. Yeah. So, unfortunately, Murray of Greed just sends him back to the deck, so... Not a lot of foolery that can be done there. I'm going to use my Call of the Atlanteans that I just pulled. And we're going to get back Heavy Infantry, Prince, and Deep Sea Diva. Because who wouldn't want a third beside you here? Well, Mario wouldn't, let's be honest. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so, pretty spooky dooky hand. Um, but actually, I could probably do a little bit more than that, to be fair. So, let's use two of those to... Let's see, what do I get with, I forget what I use with the Marmel Abyssalacia, Abyssalacia, because I know I always used to go for Miss Starboy more with this deck, but let's see. Um, during my opponent's turn, I can send a card from my hand to the graveyard at a Mermail monster. Well, that's not the worst, but pff, opponents don't get turns in this game. So let's just go for that, give everybody a nice juicy boost, activate you, and send to the graveyard Poseidra. Cause that's always fun and then we can use let's see get to my hand one of you so then there's actually multiple ways to do things gosh um, we're gonna normal summon you and that's gonna let us normal summon you and that's gonna let us get another Poseidra and that's gonna let us destroy stuff and we have a fix and we special summon more monsters. So we'll go for Atlantean Dragoons. Because why not? We get to send that back to your hand? Oh no, he just just Oh yeah, because we did it in that order. So it's just destroyed. Mm -hmm. If I let it get to Poseidra first, he would have gone back to your hand. Um, ooh, I think it might be stuck here. Because it's waiting on me, right? Uh-oh. Or might have just crashed. Wonderful. Um, well, oh, did it really? Oh. Okay, so you are here. Yeah. Um, yeah. No, I'm right. I'm right here, and it's just waiting on you. Yeah, I think it did crash, but either way, I was just messing around with you, so that would have been uh, around to the dragons, of course, sea serpents. Wait, were you about to attack though? I mean, I was about to break Eki then attack. Okay, because I had a monster that cannot be destroyed by battle with monsters other than level four below. Ah, uh, okay. Well, yeah, regardless, I was about to have a level 4 monster on the field as well. So, mm -hmm. yep, it won't let me play him, so let's uh, fast forward to the next duel. Duel. All right. You want you want me to go first again? Uh, You know what? Yeah, you can go first again. Okay. 
Let's see. Okay, so we don't have anything to really start with. Oh, well, we do. We do. We got a little something, something. Actually, pretty decent plays. Let's just go for the normal summon here, because usually if you go first with um, the Atlanteans, you kind of just want to pop out Neptibus and start setting yourself up. So, to the graveyard. We all know who's going there. It's the Dragoons! And hopefully I'll be able to use both Dragoons this time. Um, and then to my hand, we will grab the Heavy Infantry. Um, which I already had in my hand, so that was kind of a wasted pull. But I wasn't looking at my hand, I was looking at the plays. And then we'll grab a Deep Sea Diva. There we go. And that'll probably be it. Set up my hand so I can get Double Besiders out next turn. And erase your field. Now do I just leave Neptibus on the field, or do I go into the uh, Link Haribo? I'm gonna leave Neptibus out this time. Because the last time you came at me with 500 attack points. Obviously, there's probably many other things you could do instead of that. Well, I'm going to activate this. Okay. Which will allow me to get a legendary ocean, which will lower all the attack points of my monsters. I mean, the mean not attack stars? points. Level, yeah. Yeah. Gotcha. And then uh, I Obviously need to do this, but I have Marais of Greed. Here. Yeah, it's, we're upset about our Marais of Greed today, which is weird. It's draw power, but... Yeah. You know, when you have a decent hand, it's iffy draw power. Because mm -hmm. you still get a plus one off it, but... Mm. Well, let me get my Poseidra first. Hey. Oh, another I need monster? another... Yeah, you need another I monster. need it on the field, okay. Well, you can kill me at least. Mm-hmm. Then let's set down some cards. Try to even in a Poseidra deck, I only run one of them. Just because there's other ways to get out Poseidra, and that's not the most common way. So. Oh, okay. So this also hurt, this also affects your hand as well, lowering your monsters' levels. Oh, okay. Yeah, because um, it says in both players' hands and on the field by one. So don't expect any Trishul of this game. <laughs> <laughs> Very well. Um, luckily, this deck mostly plays out and doesn't bother with the extra deck. Like, as you can tell, I only have 14 in here because I just didn't care about fixing it up at, since an update. Um, but yeah, we just have our Mistar Boy is going to be one of the few things I actually do use that uh, Link Haribo play is viable. And then you do have the occasional Abyss Dweller or Totally Awesome you can go into, but now that you're dropping Mistar, is not so much. So let's um, just copy the same play, honestly. Um, yeah. Let's go for the normal summon of Heavy Infantry. So let's see if you can stop me before the full combo goes off this time. Uh oh. You wait. Uh, on... Let's see. Yeah, I'm just going to negate that. Perfect. Um, so that does stop me, but I can do something. So you're forcing me to use my one for one. Get rid of Poseidra, because we can just use him from the graveyard anyway. And special summon. Oh, I could just special summon from hand the Deep Sea Diva, but the effect only goes off when it's normal summoned. Um, I could special summon a heavy infantry, because it's now a level one thanks to your legendary ocean. Um, cause that just, yeah, just that monster's effects are negated, not guys with that name. So I could mm -hmm. go hard here, or I could just pull out uh, Neptibus. Um, let's try to go hard. Let's see what happens. Yeah, yeah. Torrential tribute. <laughs> right. <laughs> I run it in this deck cause it's water themed. Ooh, excellent. Great timing. Um, so we just have two heavy infantries out here. Um, One's a heavy defensive, at least. Yeah. Uh, but you get to activate that next turn. Next turn, yeah. So what can I go for here? You know what I want to do? I think I got a play that's just so savage it might work. Yeah, let's do it. Let's... Uh, I could, could just go for the Mistar Boy, but then you're still going to outpower me. Let's pop our Monster Reborn. And... Hmm... Let's see. Yeah, I want to do this. So, let's bring out the Warrior of the Atlantis. Why didn't I bring Poseidra? Because now I'm bringing Poseidra. And I get his bonus effects off. So, we get to clear this and... Oh. Actually, no, that's just destroying that. Um, so, I guess I might as well just destroy all this stuff. Sure, why not? And aquarium stage. 
Okay, those go back to hand. The aquarium stages effect. Oh, okay. Get to Jeez. summon out this guy in defense mode. All right. It's when it's destroyed, I can summon an aqua monster. Very nice. So yeah, I guess just pulling out a regular Poseidra would have essentially done the same thing there, but it's all good. So we'll get rid mm -hmm. of that just so you don't go into a Poseidra of your own next turn. And yeah, once again, I got well, a Deep Sea Diva combo in hand. He's not a Sea Serpent, so. Oh yeah, true. Oh yeah, it has yeah. to be a Sea Serpent. Oh man, yeah. In your deck, I just think Trident's probably a bad idea. But. Because yeah. if I run only one in an almost exclusively Sea Serpent deck. Hmm. Okay. I guess I'll normal summon. Oh gosh. Legendary Fisherman. <laughs> yep. So you'll pixelate it for you as well. Yeah, no. This well, this is one of those uh, early cards that people try to make uh, anime. So. Yeah, we imported this one from Minecraft, actually. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, and then that's all I can really do. Okay, so I still got the power. Oh, I hard drew my dragoons right before I was gonna get to use it. So said. Uh, we'll do the deep sea diva. Pop its effect, see what else we can pull out. Um, so in this case, uh, well, I guess I want to do the marksman. Um, well, no, I can still normal some. Yeah, I can still do the play. It's just in reverse now. So instead of going infantry to diva, I'll do diva to infantry. Buys me another normal summon for that. Pop the prince. And yeah, we gotta send a Poseidra to grave. Because that's the only thing that's really useful here. Or, hmm, that's, that face down is a little scary. And I don't necessarily need another Poseidra at the moment. Actually, I kind of do. Yeah, we'll just send Poseidra to grave. If I get burned from it, it's all good. And then we'll add to hand. Um, let's get some Call of the Atlanteans. Because if stuff does go wrong, that'll help me build myself back up again. And then, yeah, we're going to activate Poseidra from Grave. See if we can get another one. And do some effects. So, I will go for... Uh, what sequence do we want to go for? Um, I guess it doesn't really matter, so let's go for this, this, this. Because I'd like to send stuff back. Oh, no, that did go in that order. Very well. I'll just destroy you, I guess. Sure. And then you will let me special summon the Dragoons. And then you'll send those spells back. Sweet. I'll set this again. And, yeah, there's no real reason for me to go into these extra deck monsters at the moment. Hmm. Well, actually, I might be able to use Abyssalacia, but it wouldn't be a great use of it. Hmm. During your opponent's turn, send one card from hand to the graveyard. Well, that would actually be pretty fun. Okay, so I'm going to attack and wait, do I just win? Yeah, I guess I do. <laughs> the whole thought process wasn't really worth doing, but maybe I want to test this out anyway because it's a fun play. So we're going to attack you almost all yeah. the way. Yeah. So the, one of the things was... I was hoping, because while Umi's on the field, the legendary fisherman cannot be targeted for attacks. Ah, okay. Yeah, That's luckily Poseidra is just one of those things that gets around it. If you want to see more of Poseidra getting around stupid decks, check out Season 2 of Fight Club. There was a lot of it. Just okay, to say. Poseidra doesn't have any effect to do right now, but okay. I know. I haven't been able to play any combos because Poseidra just returns things. Yeah... All right, let's do it. Quick effect. Activate. Send Dragoons, which lets me pull you to hand. And do I get Dragoons too? Yay! I got to use the Dragoons from hand! That's all I wanted to do. Um, we'll just pull Mullen Glacier because the game's about to be over. Didn't um, they uh, up the, the number of Dragoons you can have? I don't. Not since Fight Club. It's still two. So. All right, well, I didn't get to use my Legendary Fisherman at all. Yeah. Maybe we'll pull a less countery deck against it. So feel free to suggest in the comments, guys, what deck do you want to see go up against the Legendary Fisherman? And then we'll be able to see the upgraded version of him in person. Because, let's be honest, the Poseidra's a mean dude. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you next time. See you, folks.